Hey guys, Captain Smash here. Um, we're bringing you a TRX kettlebell and light dumbbell workout that you can do at home. So I'm only doing this for my uh, private clients that I take on. All you're gonna need is a kettlebell, a pair of TRX straps or some uh, pulling apparatus and a light, dumbbell, light pair of dumbbells. So we're going to start off the day with some kettlebell deadlifts, some single arm shoulder press, and TRX rows. Now this workout is all based upon reps, so you're just trying to get to your top end rep range as quickly and as fast as possible. So um, we're gonna start with 30 reps on the deadlifts, 20 reps on the shoulder press, and then 40 reps on the TRX row or whatever sort of pulling apparatus you have at home. All right, here we go. So the deadlift, line up for the deadlift, get that belt right in between, and then we're just dropping the hips, picking up the chest, and we're just gonna wrap it up. Super easy, right? So our next one is the kettlebell shoulder press. We're gonna rip the bell up, make sure it's in the crook of the arm, resting up, and up into the chest and your thumb is into your throat. You're gonna take the bell, press it out and up at the same time, okay? We're just gonna rock and roll, trying to stay really strict form, nice and tight from the body, throwing the other arm out to activate the core. And always remember, keep that kettlebell going straight through your wrist. I like to open my hand, that way I can go straight up and down. Now just for the video purposes, I'm just gonna do about 12 to 15 reps per side. Okay, and we're just cruising right along through here. Now, remember, with the kettlebell, you're kind of collapsing the bell into the chest each rep, and then you're coming out. So you swing that arm out as you press. Open the barn door, close the barn door, open the barn door, up overhead, close the barn door. Okay? Keep that core nice and tight as you go. Get as far along as you can on those reps, okay? Then we're gonna go right into our rows. Make these rows nice and tough. Get a good squeeze in the shoulder blades. And you're gonna continue on with that circuit. If you're fatiguing before you get to your 30 reps, that's okay. Just move on to the next exercise, wash, rinse, repeat until all the reps are done. Next, we're gonna go into kettlebell squats, dumbbell lateral raises, single arm kettlebell rows, okay? So the kettlebell squat, we're just gonna goblet squat it. So get the bell up. You can go by the horns or go by the ball, dig the handle into the chest. And again, we're shoot for about 30 reps total. So push the hips back and drive up to the top. Try to get nice and deep in these. Again, I'm only doing 15 reps. You guys at home, try to push for that 30. Finish my 15, grab my light set of dumbbells. These ones are gonna be a little harder. So we're gonna to try to beat those up for 20. Then we're gonna follow with a single arm kettlebell row. So we get to the end of our set. We're gonna brace up in a nice split stance. One elbow on the knee. Grab our kettlebell and drive that elbow back. Straight back there, nice solid row. And again, we're going about 30 reps with these. Just gonna set it down, switch the stance, brace up on that knee. Make sure you're keeping your back nice and level. Don't be all folded over. Make sure your chest is up tall. So that's the end of the second circuit. 
So all in the squats, you're doing 30 reps. Dumbbell lateral raises, 30 reps. Single arm kettlebell row, 20 reps. I misspoke earlier. Finally, at the end, we're just gonna tackle a little bit of core. You're gonna do a front plank, 60 seconds by four sets, okay? So you're just gonna hop on the ground, get a nice elbow plank going, and then hold for 60 seconds. So make sure in your elbow plank, you're working your core hard. If you've got a little bit of air in there, you're tightening it up. Control, control the core. Make sure your hips are nice and level and really squeeze for that full 30 seconds. You're gonna do that for four sets. All right, so we're only operating these for my, uh, my members here at the Strength Lab. So I hope you enjoy. If you need a, if you want a written copy of it, I have it typed out. So go ahead and give me a line and I will shoot that to you. All right, talk to you soon.